Hello again. I work a lot with steel. I do a lot of welding. I've been welding for a long time, so I know how to do it pretty well. I figured I'd give you a little video clip on what I like. And if you're looking to get into welding, maybe a machine that you might like. I'll try and keep this short and sweet. Millermatic 140 auto set welder. It's a beautiful machine. Without the tank on the back, just the machine in the cart. I bought off a tool truck. I think it was $1,100. It might be a little less expensive now. That was about eight years ago. But this is a bonehead machine. The auto set feature, you can set your wires speed or you can set it to the auto set feature 0.024.030. Depending on the type of wire you have in the machine. I have 024 in the machine. So I set the auto set for 024. The only other thing I have to do with this machine is set the thickness. It goes from 24 gauge to 3 16 or 1 8. And you just measure the gauge of steel you're working with and set it there. Maybe tune it in just a little bit as you're welding in between welds. And that's it. Get yourself a good clean ground for your ground. Good clean space to weld, auto set to your wire, set your thickness, point and shoot. Wire comes out, the gas comes out all automatic and the wire speed will adjust as to the, the reading that the machine gets from the current going through the metal. Technology is a wonderful thing. This machine I love it. I have another miller at work. It doesn't have the auto set feature, but it's the first machine I bought. So I really know how to use it. I got accustomed to it. I love this machine though. If I could have this machine at work, I would, but I like it better here at home. The only other thing you're going to need other than this welder, tank of gas, about a hundred dollars, maybe 120, depending on the size tank you get. This is a pretty big tank. You can get a, uh, shorter tank when it's about half as tall you just have to refill it more often get yourself a welding helmet this is a flip down welding helmet the other style you can get is an auto darkening welding helmet a flip down welding helmet you can probably get these for 25 bucks now at harbor freight it's a flip down welding helmet nothing can go wrong auto darkening welding helmet it auto darkens the instant you start welding. So you can leave it down and see through it up until the point you pull the trigger. It's a beautiful thing. Makes life really convenient. But it's about $250 to $350 depending on the brand and the one you get. I don't remember the exact price on this one. I got it off the tool truck. They're expensive. Don't skimp if you're going to go with an auto darkening helmet. Don't skimp. It's your eyes you're working with. If you skimp on your helmet, you might get some flash burn on your eyes. It doesn't feel good. I've got it a couple times. It doesn't feel good. I didn't get it because of the auto darkening helmet. I got it because I wasn't wearing a helmet. So be smart, be safe. And I'll do a couple videos on tips and tricks that I've learned. Help you weld. Things to look for. Things not to do. Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit like. I'll see you next time. Be safe.